Welcome to this video. In the previous video, we had learned to find the mean of grouped data by the step deviation method. Today we will see an interesting example based on this. The following frequency distribution records the weight of 50 apples. So, can you find the nearest mean weight of these apples? Let's see. We know that in order to find the mean, we first need to find the midpoint of this distribution table, which we find from the class intervals and show it in the table. To simplify the mean, assume 97.5 as the assumed mean A from among the xi and obtain the mean difference di between xi and a. Can you tell me what we will have to do next? Correct. To further simplify the mean, we will use the step deviation method, where we calculate the ui, that is, divide the di by the class interval h, which is 5, and form a table. To find the mean, multiply each ui by fi and find the sum of their products and the sum of the frequencies fi. Substituting the values of the assumed mean a, the class interval h, summation fi ui and summation fi in the above formula and solving, we obtain the mean as 95.90. So, we can say that the nearest mean weight of apples is 96 grams. So, hopefully you must have understood the examples to find the mean based on the step deviation method. But note that the step deviation method will be applicable only if there is a common factor in all the DI. Today we saw an example based on finding the mean of grouped data by the step deviation method.